This is the flash effect and freeze frame. First, uh, add your movie scene, and I've already added it here. And then find the place where you would like to uh, do the freeze frame and flash, right about there. And then do a hard cut. Select both your audio and your video. Use Shift K to do the hard cut. That will give you the freeze frame when you extend out the uh, end of the video clip. So select the end and drag it out. Move it 30 frames, that's about right. And then select a shutter sound. And I have several on this clip. So I'm just going to find the shutter sound that I like. And you can use K or Shift K, it doesn't really matter. Delete the ends. And then move the beginning of the clip to about at the very end of your video. Now we need to add the flash effect. So add a effect strip color. And of course you want it to be white, so we're going to be changing that. Move it so that it's right at the end of your uh, video clip, or the beginning of the freeze effect. And I'm not going to use a solid white, I'm going to use something about 0.8 and uh, then change this to either add or alpha over. I'm going to use add as the uh, blend mode. Now we're going to be keyframing the multiply effect or the multiply uh, value. So put your cursor at the beginning of the uh, color strip and put a keyframe for a value of 1 and move about nine frames down. That's a good length for the flash effect. And change the multiply value to zero and keyframe that. And that's about it. This is what uh, you can maybe change the slope to vector if you want, but I'll just leave it at busier. And this is what it looks like. All right, so thanks for watching. Okay, you may have heard of me. That was from New York.